Now that you've hopefully enjoyed watching our campground favorite video on Oregon's Silver Falls State Park, let's show you what Silver Falls is famous for, waterfalls, oh, and hiking. While we didn't really plan ahead for visiting this park, remember we pretty much just wing it on our trips. We do research ahead of time, but decide where to go based upon weather, what's not on fire, and simply how we feel at the time. We learned about the Trail of Ten Falls by watching a video on Within Hiking Distances YouTube channel. They planned ahead, had backpacks, water bottles, and the right shoes. We had the water bottles, but someone had on boat shoes. So yeah, seven and a half miles of hiking in deck shoes after six nights of family fun, <laughs> not gonna happen. So we picked a few easy ones. We headed to the parking lot for the North Falls and the parking fee was included in our campground fee. North Falls is 136 feet tall This is one of the four amphitheater waterfalls, where the basalt has been eroded away and the trail leads you behind these majestic falls. The undercut behind the falls extends back at least 100 feet, a bit creepy. And stairs, again, not really a trail for boat shoes. It's green and gorgeous. Next up, we hike the offshoot trail to Upper North Falls. This is a wider and shorter waterfall at 65 feet. Still pretty and really a nice trail. Extremely well made and maintained. By the way, this trail is dog friendly and Lexi, rest in peace girl, would have loved swimming here. A quick stop at a viewpoint to see the falls from up above. We then drove back to the main parking lot for the overlook to South Falls. South Falls can be viewed from many viewpoints, and this is one of the four walk-behind falls and plunges 177 feet. Dogs are not permitted on the canyon trail, i.e. the Trail of Ten Falls, except for on the Upper North Falls side trail. In addition to our short hikes and viewing a few waterfalls, we want to check out the visitor center, find a magnet, check out the CCC building, read a little of the history, and see the day use area, which has a swimming beach and off-leash dog area. There's also a cafe here, closed at the time of our visit, but a place that would be just fantastic in the winter. Friends of Silver Falls volunteers run the gift shop and it's well worth a stop. Silver Falls State Park is absolutely beautiful and has endless hiking opportunities, a nice campground, loads of waterfalls to view, and really is one of Oregon's gems. Not quite sure how we've missed it all these years, but there's literally so much to see and do in Oregon. We need years. So, thanks to Within Hiking Distance for inspiring us to see the Trail of Ten Falls. Well, our shortened version anyway, because their video brought us here. If you've enjoyed this rather lazy visit to the waterfalls of Silver Falls State Park, give us a thumbs up, 
Subscribe if you haven't already done so, and please leave us a comment so we know you were here. And as always, thanks for watching.